Hey guys, and welcome to another YouTube channel of ours. Uh, I am at a special place, and it is in Minerva, Ohio. Um, I decided to do a video of this park right here that we are at, and as you guys can see, is this is a beautiful, beautiful park. I love the trees here, which we're in my vehicle right now, but yeah, there's a stage right there. Um, you can have concerts here. Uh, this is where we have our Oktoberfest most of the time. And the homecoming right here. And right now we're in the play area for the kids. Which we have a guy that's little mowing the lawn of the park right here. We'll see him coming up. There he is. And there's a cop right over there. As we're just sitting here, you know, thinking, you know, uh, there's a bridge right there. If you guys want to see the bridge, there's the bridge right there. And right behind that is the community pool, which it wasn't open this year because of the COVID, which kind of stinks. But there is a walking path, and there is a creek up ahead right there, too. There's a creek, which we should walk up to it. Um, let me see. But these are, this is a place for the kids to go play. Um, there's a lot of activity. There's another park around here, too. See, we got people that wants to go play at the park right now. They just got out of school, you know. Uh, which the high school... If you guys can see, the high school is just right there. There's our the high school. Like I said, we're going to be right towards it. The Minerva High School. Which their kids, the kids are getting out of school in just uh, probably in a few minutes. But let's go take a walk. A little walk around the park. Who knows, she might be a Karen, I don't know. <laughs> but we're not going to videotape her. We're just going to ignore her. But we are going to go to see the creek. And, oh, I better not lock the door. But yeah, this is a beautiful, beautiful park. I was going to catch it before the kids got out of school. But I had some interruptions. Not by accident. I mean, it is by accident, actually. What am I saying? But yeah, this is where we have our the Oktoberfest around here. But I love the trees around here. And there's another bridge. And beyond that bridge, it's got a swing set over there. A pavilion. A skate park a little bit. A little skate park. A tennis court back there. You know, and this is where the walking park is. The walking track is for people to come and walk around and walk their dogs. We got some dogs over there. The baseball field. You know. And where they have their homecoming is on the other side of the creek right here. We have our homecoming every year. Which we didn't have it this year it was because of the covent. Again, here's our flagpole. There's the flagpole. Now they have a... Uh, a fireplace around here and I've been trying to find it and I cannot find it but here's the creek which it's usually higher than this when the rain comes but yeah look at that creek a beautiful creek it goes all the way down and right that building right there is the cheese factory so you're right behind the cheese factory. If you go into my other video of Minerva, Ohio, you'll see the cheese factory from the front of it. And that's where that big cow is where you can take a picture of. But yeah, this is the play area here for the kids. And I think it's wonderful. But right now we're on the walking path. Let's get you down here. So well, let's go find to see if we can find this... Uh, What 
which like I said the kids are starting to get out of school they'll be out of school probably about an hour or two and you'll see a lot of school kids you know walking down through the park we have a police officer right there he keeps our community safe so we I salute him because he's putting his life on the line every day to keep this community safe and protected but yeah we have a kid that's in the tennis court skateboarding you should be on the skate park it is nice to walk around and this walking park is I have not been on this walking path but let's go in the wooden area bridge <laughs> hi but yeah they said there's a fireplace here a history fireplace here and I still can't find but yeah, if I go up there, then the police officers will wave to you if you wave to them, you know, to show them respect and everything. But yeah, he's just uh, making sure the kids are going to be going home safe for the day and everything else. There are some kids are out here already. Because some of them are, most of them are homeschooled. But yeah, look at this beautiful creek. So let's see how far this uh, walking path goes. I mean, we're right by the high school right now. There's one of the buses. So it's good to walk the walking path. So I'm going to go back up, up through here. We're going to be in the parking lot, almost to the parking lot, right next to the parking lot of the high school. Which I don't need to. So let's see how far this walking path goes. <laughs> okay, it looks like it's done just right here. Because it makes a new trail. And we're going to have some, there's going to be some joggers around here. But I don't want to go back in there because my walking path is like going towards that high school. And I don't want to go near the high school because I don't want to disturb and that police officer will come up and says, hey, you're just, you're trespassing. But well, let's uh, check this uh, path out. Yeah, it looks like, oh, it's going back to that other wooden area back there. See it? So let's see if that uh, walking path goes back in there which we will be checking. See, the school buses are lining up for the kids. See? Which we're going to go and keep walking, and we're not even going to disturb the kids. We're not... I want to see if there's a walking trail back in there. You might give me a ticket or something. I don't know. I've never been back in here. But, yeah wonder if there's another path, but I don't want to get on the school grounds because, no, it doesn't not. But you'll see the track team running through here, and, oh yeah, look at the creek now. Look at that. I just don't want to get on school grounds, so we're going to go back, because I don't want to get on school grounds, and... I have no business being at the high school itself. So I'll just go on my way here. Here comes another school bus. But yeah. Sorry, I'm a I'm a little chicken because I don't want to get trespassed or anything else and my daughter still attends to the school, but 
since this COVID hit, I just don't want to disturb the people and the teachers and all that. Plus, that cop is really making me nervous, but I just don't want to go on school grounds right now. So if we went on the other way, which I still haven't found that fireplace at yet. Unless the stage is the fireplace. Which we're just going to keep walking and... Yeah, I think the stage is the fireplace. But yeah, you can have your concerts out here for an outside and... People come out here for the Oktoberfest and the homecoming. And enjoy the daylight. But this is a beautiful, beautiful park. I say. It's good for filming, too. This park is very good for filming. Uh, maybe we should cross that bridge. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's the dead end back in there. So I don't want to disturb the kids. I don't want to trespass or anything. Now, if it was summertime, then yeah, and the kids ain't in school, that would be a different story. But, but yeah, look at all that. That is awesome. But yeah, now you can really see the cheese factory. Look at the cow uh, stacks right there. Look at that. Sorry, I'm walking, but I can stop. There you go. <laughs> See, this this place could be good for filming. They exercise here. They walk around. They've got teachers and staff walks around when their breaks up. Sometimes the community helps the park out too. There's a guy that walks his dogs. Beautiful dogs, too. Beautiful dogs. We'll just won't disturb the dogs because we don't want them to bark at us. And we don't know what they are capable of. They could be canines, who knows? Training their dogs. It's good so far it's a good, beautiful day to walk. Finally, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That was a lady that has just walked past us. Now we're back to the play area, but we're going to cross this bridge right here. As of right now, nobody's breaking in my car. Which, this community is awesome. But let's go cross this bridge. And it looks like they changed it up a little bit for the park. Oh. We're just walking around. I don't want to look suspicious. <sighs> but yeah, like I said, that Chris is on the road again. And I decided to download this and show you our beautiful park. One of our parks here. Plus the trees is the one that uh, expires me the most here. But yeah, it's good for a place for filming on a park scene. Now you can see the other side of the park where we were just at. See? There's my car right there. Yeah. Then up here is, this is where the rides on the homecoming, this is where the ride area is, you know? Amusement park rides. And they put them right here, at, right at the baseball field. And then you'll get your vendors and your food and and stuff like that. Then you go into the community building, which that's that white building right there. That's the community building right there. To look at crafts and stuff at the homecoming. And at the Oktoberfest, they always have a concert because... The band of White Buffalo Woman comes and plays for us. And that's their band. And if you guys haven't heard from them, you guys need to go check them out. Because this is their hometown also. Not just mine, but theirs too. And I have not spotted them. 
which the question is that I have for them is why is there a woman in your title and it's a boy band but that's all I wanted to say you know I don't want to be rude to them or anything else yeah and I'm hoping that they're making it for their band and everything but they are really really good you know if you like that sort of music well yeah and right here is at the October I think yeah this is where all the vendors will be over there they'll be over here you know it's an enjoyment and then they'll have right by the basketball court they'll put a st little stage for like music entertainment on the homecoming and then every year we'll have Ohio pro wrestlers coming down here to do a show for them you know like they'll do the wrestling you know down here Ohio professional wrestlers come down here and give us a show you know and it is awesome I better speed up yeah but that's where and right there's the cheese factory right there you know we're getting closer to it and there is also a store in that building too that you guys can go check out oh it went blurry on me okay there it is <laughs> but yeah especially in the summertime it's pretty cool they also have tractor pulls over there little uh, lawnmower tractor pulls over there usually and then the pool area is just right up ahead after this bridge so we'll probably get to that but yeah this is where the kids play basketball at I mean this is one of the parts of my book too which I didn't mention there's a hollow tree which there was a hollow tree in my uh, book too you know see the hollow tree I love hollow trees they're awesome look at that tree that is awesome I love hollow trees they're so beautiful which there is a hollow tree in the book if you guys go get poor Starla we got people taking a break and there's some monkey bars if you guys want to do uh, chin ups you know there's a lot of people that climb up on this and you know I don't think anybody got serious hurt on it though but yeah this is monkey bars you could do your chin ups here you could do whatever you want here and then there's a high bar right here which that's pretty cool <clears throat> Okay, we're coming up to the community pool area. Which right now we're across the street from the firehouse, which if you didn't see the firehouse the first time, you need to go down to the, go watch Minerva, Ohio, founder 1833 or I don't think I downloaded it on my other channel, Teresa Signs, yet. But yeah, there's the pool area right here. Our community pool, and it's shaped as a cross of the community pool area. Right there. It's pretty, if you go look on Google Maps and you can see the shape of the pool, it is a cross. It was just like they rebuilt that pool not too long ago to make it as a cross. And I think it was pretty cool, but there's the creek again. All the way down there. Then we're coming back to, we're going to go down this way. And then we'll be back to the car. But yeah, this is called Brock Park, if you guys want to know what kind of park this is. Brock Park. This is where all the festivals takes place, right here. 
you know this is where all the festivals takes place right here and downtown uh, Minerva Ohio I've been down here since 2005 and I enjoy every single moment of this Minerva Ohio deal nice community nobody bothers you you know that cop is following me <laughs> no he's just doing his job he'll be okay but he's a nice guy these these cops are nice down here just don't show disrespect of them and they'll show some respect of you you know they're just checking out the park to make sure everything is secured and everything and they also go through neighborhoods too which that's cool okay so which way should we go that way or that way let's go that way because I want to get back to the car and I'm hoping that you guys enjoy this video please like subscribe comment favorites all that good stuff and I'm hoping that you enjoyed this video and see what you think so come on down and enjoy this Brock Park in Minerva Ohio later <laughs>